Hello, many coca flopless here again with another set of Greekisms. Right? The mustache is coming in, it's looking fucking sick. I've got a bit of growth. I look like a Brunswick hipster that is sitting at a cafe with his fucking almond latte, writing a screenplay about a cunt who went suck with his fucking housemate, and now things have got awkward between them, and they've got to have a fucking house meeting. You fucked up, Darren. You should have waited till that end of lockdown party and had a crack at a friend today. You know, the one that flirted with you on New Year's Eve. Now you got to fix your hair every time you leave your room to take a piss. So the management, that garlic breath, asked me to make an announcement for them. I said, yeah, I'll make a fucking announcement for you. First, you've got to upgrade my ergalia. That means my tools. Because I want to give you guys the best. So there was a bit of back and forth between me and the fucking Psonio Arabatsis. But finally, he agreed. You did, didn't you? Yeah, you know what's best for you and your fucking channel. So they ended up buying me this Canon 200 fucking Magnum PI, whatever the fuck it is, camera. I think it looks fucking nice. It's a little bit more cinematic. And we're rocking it. So the announcement they wanted me to make is something about fucking subscribing and whatnot and sharing and posting and malakias like that. So if you want to subscribe there, share the video, spread the word out, tell them there's a new sheriff in town that are malakias and I'm telling you what's what. So today's set of Greekisms are a bit of a follow-on from my life tip number 16 where I discuss the use of a glanya as a way to keep people in check. Today we'll be talking about how you can use it as a way to keep your mates in check. Let's be honest, sometimes our mates need to be kept in check a little just relax a little bit but also for the person who is being kept in check to be able to use it himself as a way to maintain a little bit of his sense of mangya okay so let's get into it number one Restrictions are eased, and you're catching up with your mates at the park. Your friend Steve fancies himself as a bit of an Adonis, you know, likes to keep fit and whatnot, and he's talking shit. So he goes, can't wait to get back to the gym, I'm going to be benching 180. And you go, Cigare mi soufi clanya. Cigare mi soufi clanya. Now that literally means, careful man, so a fart doesn't escape you. In other words, don't strain yourself, dickhead. Calm down, take it easy, you might squeeze out a fruit. Or it could mean the most you're going to be able to do is squeeze out a little fart. That's it. Relax it out. Number two. The conversation is continuing and Steve is still trying to outdo everyone, talking over the top of everyone, interrupting. Finally, you say to him, Steve, you tipe taise san klanya. Steve, you tipe taise san klanya. Now that literally means, Steve, why are you jumping in like a fart? In other words, why do you keep interrupting? You're cutting through the conversation, there. Right? You're interrupting the same way a fart would, and it's not positive. And number three, let's be honest, there. Right? Steve has struggled a little bit during this conversation. He's tried to get in edgeways, and he hasn't been able to find his magyar, eh? And finally, he just goes all out, and he says, fuck everything, fuck lockdown, I don't fucking wear the mask, I don't abide by the curfew, I drive wherever the fuck I want. And you say to him, Steve, take it easy, there. if the cops catch you, they're going to fine you. And he goes, Thame klasum tarhidia. Thame klasum tarhidia. Now that literally means they're going to fart on my balls. In other words, they're not going to do jack shit, re. Fuck them, re. What are they going to do, re? They're not going to be The best thing they're going to be able to manage to do is fart on my nuts. That's it. That's a nice one. That's a way to maintain my gear. Who's going to argue with that, re? So there's three little glanya related Greekisms to keep your mates in check and also to retain a little bit of magya as well. And to Darren, you're fucked up there, move out, come see me and let's talk about it and let's work out your next move. First thing you need to do there is get out of that fucking hipster cafe and hit a real cafe near. That's where you'll find me. No, no. Take care, all the best, wear a mask and other rest. I'll see you again. Oh,